Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm no problem. complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Not bad. Well, I'd say I'm doing I fairly well. how good you are at this. You should pace yourself though. We have a lot of tests to do. I am looking forward to that. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Oops, I was not looking where I was going. Hello. I, I don't know what you were doing there, but okay. doing you look like you're having problems so do you let's just go about well done here come the test results you are a horrible person thank you that's what it says a horrible person we weren't even testing for that well, good then it can be like penicillin We've established I'm a horrible person by accident. We stumbled upon penicillin by accident. So many beautiful things science has done for us. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. Well, it's too just bad it a is. data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Well, that's good. Congratulations. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Well, fuck you. I, I find that I am perfectly fine the way I am. Oh, you're quiet this time. You're navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Um, I don't do much when I'm not destroying this facility. Ignore that, that was a perfectly, perfectly well executed jumpy over laser thing. <laughs> perfectly well executed. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Okay, I Why died once. The Wasn't that we'll slow? Continue the testing. Wasn't that slow, was I?
So I'm actually going through these really quickly. Ah, oh, like me cleaning my room. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faceplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Oh, well, um... I'd say this is probably the most fun I've ever had. I don't know about you. There's music coming from the queue, or there was. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too Looking expensive faster. to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. Ah, fantastic. Because, you know, that's, that's what... I don't know, that's what the space people do. Space people. Astronauts, wow, that's what... Nice going. <sighs> Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial face plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. That sounds like fun. Maybe you should not make places out of... Or, um... Should not make rooms out of glass. Just for future reference. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. I shall stand in its way. I want this. Okay. Also, you don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Press the button again. Also, this is my new friend. He's our friend. He's coming with us. Let's go on adventure. When I was talking about smelly oh. garbage standing around being useless, that was a metaphor. I was actually Just talking go. about you, and I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head, which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Oh, thanks. I, I guess that was an insult for me. But I, I was not, I was not in the game. You get me? You understand what Did I mean? You know people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises. Really? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. Bitch. Oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. I will happily take them off your hands. I would actually love a companion cube, IRL. Yeah, that's right, I need the cube. Huh. 
Ha, nailed it. Okay, I didn't think so, but I thought I'd try anyways. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Okay. Don't take anything with you. I think I can. Like, they wouldn't give me the challenge if they didn't think I could, but... Who knows? Hey, I think I can. I genuinely think I can. Just, let's just try to get the companion cube out here real quick. Okay, so that's that. Not things we there. I'm just gonna sit up there. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay. Okay, I think that's probably close enough for us to do this now. I think there's a way to. Oh, wait a minute. Ha, did it. So knew what I was doing there, guys. Did it. Did it. I think that one was about to say, I love you. And they are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. Fuck you, that was my friend. That was my friend. She killed my friend, bitch.
This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Yes, I remember because you killed my friend. Oh no, the turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There, if you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. Um, okay, I did not catch any of what you said there, but in post-editing, I am going to go and find out what you said, and put it in- In slow-mo. Like, right here. And now we will know exactly what was said. Except I won't until later. When I edit this. For you guys. But you'll know.